I'm Grace Allison Blair. Welcome to my Facebook page for finding your way to having conversations with God. I'm an award-winning author who is also a Christian mystic, and I want to share with you some ideas of how to tap into those creative ideas that inspire us. Now, being a Christian mystic may raise some eyebrows, so let's just go over what, a defi what the definition is for being a Christian mystic. And I think you might find that you're one too. So according to the dictionary, a mystic is a person who seeks by contemplation and self-surrender to obtain unity with or absorption into the deity or the absolute, or who believes in the spiritual apprehension of truths that are beyond the intellect. And that is what we're exploring here. I want each person who has joined with us to share who you are, why you're here, and perhaps one of those experiences that you have had that are beyond words. Things that have happened to you where you feel as though you've had a special intervention. I know for me, one of those was when I was 40, 1990, diagnosed with cervical cancer. And the night before surgery, I had the most incredible experience of the Holy Spirit. And the next day, there was no cancer. Now I've had experiences um, that weren't quite as dramatic. And just recently, for example, I chose to do this Facebook page after prayer. I asked God, I said, okay, 2019 is in front of me. What can I do to make a difference? And so this Facebook page was born. Having conversations with God is within each person. Being a mystic is within each person. So I want us to share those experiences. And for those of you who are authors, um, please, I would appreciate you not promoting your books right now, but rather share how it is you came to write those books. What, it, what were those experiences that you had that were so illuminating that you were, you were actually inspired to write them? Now I've got one book over here. Do you have a dream that was inspired? And the other book, Einstein's Compass. They're all about finding your special experience with God, your conversation with God. So I put my two books in this arena as far as how I got here. 40 years of going inside has given me, I guess you call an expert in this field. But you know, you're experts too. So I want you to share what those are. And when you go to read other people's experiences, please make a comment, not just um, a check mark or a little emoji, but really share something that you feel touched you about their experience. I think social media is a good thing, but in a way, we're not connected. And this, I, I'm hoping, will help us connect more with each other with our hearts, with our conversations with God that come from within. And this is a safe place. And please keep your opinions of others, uh, perhaps to yourself, and honor each person's space. We are here to share in an open, honest, loving environment. And I want you all to jump in. Let's have fun. Let's share what those conversations of God have been for you, and perhaps we can inspire others. Sure, we're not finished here on this planet, and until we are, we're going to have many more challenges. But how we meet those challenges, that's the important thing I would think we need to focus on, those inner conversations with God and what happens. So here we go.